Welcome to our Climate Indicators series. This episode is on the Marine Species Distribution Indicator. This information is gathered from the U.S. GCRP Indicator Platform. Climate indicators show trends over time in key aspects of our environment, including greenhouse gas levels in the atmosphere, temperatures across land and sea, and extent of Arctic sea ice. To learn more about climate indicators, make sure to check out our separate video here for a quick introduction. The Marine Species Distribution Indicator examines changes in the location of fish, shellfish, and other marine species along U.S. coast. Rising water temperatures affect the environments where marine species live, causing them to migrate to cooler waters in the summer and back in the winter. However, as climate change causes the oceans to become warmer year-round, populations of some species adapt by shifting away from areas that have become too warm. Water temperature is not the only factor that can cause marine animal populations to shift. However, interactions with other species, harvesting, ocean circulation patterns, habitat change, and species' ability to disperse and adapt can influence marine populations. This graph shows the annual change in latitude, shown by the orange line, and depth, shown by the blue line of 140 marine species along the northeastern U.S. coast and in the eastern Bering Sea. These show that overall, fish and shellfish in these regions are moving northward and deeper to cooler waters. These maps show the annual average locations for three species, Alaska pollock, snow crab, and Pacific halibut in the eastern Bering Sea from 1982 to 2018, and for three species, American lobster, red hank, and black sea bass along the northeastern U.S. coast from 1973 to 2018. Dots are shaded from light to dark to show change over time. The marine species distribution indicator is important because Fisheries and fishing communities are at high risk from the impacts of climate change. In particular, changes in the distribution, timing, and productivity of fish and shellfish. Fisheries management that incorporates climate knowledge can help reduce impacts, promote resilience, and increase the value of marine resources. For more information, visit globalchange.gov forward slash indicators and make sure to subscribe to our channel to stay updated.